Good morning angels and welcome back to the weekly vlog. So I'm coming at you a little worse for wear. I am going to get my brows and lashes done and I haven't faked out so I'm looking very pale. I feel see through, I can't lie. However, so this morning I'm going, it's 10 to 9, I've been for a dog walk. I'm going to take my laptop into repair i'm gonna get myself a costa coffee then i'm gonna go and get my lashes and brows done my lashes look pretty good but obviously it just helps them like i have to curl them for them to look this good so i'm excited to get those done i am shattered i've had such a bad sleep the last three four nights and honestly i'm feeling really tired now i I'm aching so bad from doing the garden at the weekend. I'll show you a little um, look of it when we get back. So we're going to do more this afternoon in it. Um, it is school time, so I'm stuck in a little bit of traffic. I probably should have gone the wrong way, as there's a school up here. But that's okay. I it's beautiful weather. It's eight. Oh no, it's not eighteen. It's thirteen degrees already, and it's sunny. There was warmth on my face when I was walking, and I don't think you can ask for much more than that. So it's meant to be a really nice week, which I'm so happy about. And yeah, here's to a positive week. I still haven't come on, so hopefully I'm due on. Well, I say hope. I don't really want to come on, but I'm probably due on this week, and then that will be, and then I can just get that out of the way because it's been pending for a couple of weeks. The good old period has. So hopefully that will appear this week. Say hello, say goodbye. Bye bye. Oh, what is the best way to go? I don't know. It's fine. So yeah, I didn't attend the gym this morning. I just, I'm in so much pain from doing the garden. I just couldn't do it. So I have just been for a nice walk. I will go for another walk later. And I'm just gonna try and get back into routine and have a nice week so when i get to, i don't know what to get from costa leaf guy had an iced white mocha from costa and i wonder what that would taste like I, or i don't know whether to play it safe and just get an iced vanilla latte because i haven't had a drink yet this morning I haven't had a coffee or a matcha or anything so i saved myself i thought it'd be nice to get one from town on my way so we'll go and get a coffee together and i will see you when i get town let's pray we can get a parking space Okay, got myself. Oh, Hang on, Jay Hooks. Really Ice vanilla latte, taste test. Not bad. Not bad. I got myself the snack milk vanilla wafers because I am super hungry. And I wafers are my guilty pleasure, but I never have them. move and I'm gonna drive got 24 minutes to go let's go see you when I get there all the crazy shit I did tonight but your girlfriend calling telling me you're barring so no starting talk fly you out to Lagos I can make it famous it's a movie in here all she wanna do is Netflix and chill so it's safe like he's just a rental one night then you got sentimental smile and pack your bags real good baby cause you'll be gone for a while I see it's on the beach down in Mexico Obsessed with this song at the minute, thanks Jode. What you drinking? Now won't you have a double with me? I got your message by the way. Come on, baby, you say goodnight to you. Holding me back, gravity is holding me back. In this world, it's just us. Shit, I'm in my best life. I'm a big pop mixed with two pop. Hey, cash, cash. I can't believe they wanna see me lose that bad. I told you I'm living my best life. Homegrown alligator, see you later. Time flies by in the yellow and green. Bring the beat down. Let's get our vocals. Lily, I'm getting You're 
your soul I'll see you later Yeah I ain't bothered, but I like her Got a vibe so we did an all-nighter You and me are like Ricky and Bianca You right? Yeah, you Sat down and had the chat And now she's back in my bed I am just waiting for Beth to come and get me. I'm dying for a wave. Just text thinking, never we please. Finish my coffee. I've still got half my wafers left. I'm going to put my lip balm on. And then I am ready to put chewing gum in. And we're all good. I can't wait for you, Glow, to be back. I'm going to have a go at it tonight. Oh, it's, there's just so much I need to do. I've got so much to do. There we go. Um. Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel like chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced See, no one else, let me like you do That's why I don't mind, I spend my life with you I wanna please you in any way I can I wanna share my world Look how long my eyelashes look! Oh, I'm obsessed. They look a little bit dark, my eyebrows, as always, but that's obviously the way they're meant to look. I can't believe my eyelashes. They look so fucking long. I'm going to drive home. Hello, I'm home. Here's what we're looking like. I can't believe how long my eyelashes look. I'm so confused. So, ordered HelloFresh, like paid for it myself, and I think it's come twice. Um... Let me just make sure you can't see any addresses. This is the one that came on Saturday and it needs to go in the fridge. So let's just see if it's the same. So we've got, let's just check if this is mine. No, I don't think it is. I don't, I'm sure I didn't pick these. I think I've got somebody else's order. Let me open this one. I picked. Right, that isn't mine. What do I do? I don't know what I do with that. Obviously, we've got more meals, so maybe we'll have to double up for lunch as well. I don't know. I mean, obviously, I'm happy, but I feel bad. It's got my name on and everything. I'm a bit confused. I haven't um, had any gifted or anything. I haven't paid for two, I don't think. I hope not. Anyway, so what about 10 different meals to choose from? So we've got blue cheese, cheddar and bacon gratin, spicy creamy Cajun chicken pasta, creamy aubergine curry, presto bacon and mushroom linguine, sun-dried tomato risotto. I don't really like sun-dried tomatoes. What? Tomatoes. Peri-peri glazed sweet potato, roast pepper, Greek cheese and spicy herb. Honey and mustard sausage tray bake. Um, is that it? Oh, and then sticky sweet chili beef. 
beef noodles. We've had that one before. So I'm a bit confused what, how we've got all these. And I also ordered a denim jacket from POT. The OG jacket that I've got, this one, they bought it out in a different colour. So, and Joe picked it up and I was like, I need that. And it was really out of stock for ages. So, it was in stock last night when I checked and I got like 15% off. The only size they had was a 16 or a 6. So I'll pick the 16 off. Oh, let's try it on. You can know my paleness. Obviously it's going to be big, but here's the colour difference. of the, They're both huge. What size is this? This one's a... That one's a 14. So Joe had a 14 anyway. Um, but she said this one's a bit smaller. This is the vibe. Love it. Obviously it's massive, but that's what I'd want. That's really nice. I love the washed kind of colour of it. I mean, it absolutely washes me out right now, but they're such good denim jackets. I think they're like 30 something pound, which is not bad. So I don't know what to do because I don't know if to make, I don't know whether to see if Dan will be home before lunch and ask him if he wants a hello fresh seeing as we've got 900 meals. So that's what I'm up to. Um, what time will you be home around? And I'm going to go to my nan's to go to her sister's because she needs to get something. And then we've got that roller to the vets at four because basically one of his testicles hasn't come down. And she said that right from the start, that one was, she could only ever feel one. And basically, it's not good for it to be up because the, I don't, I didn't know this personally, but even like men, just all male creatures, like with testicles, if they're hot, they like drop. So they're away from the body. And if they're cold, they're not like harder and shrivel up because they have to be the perfect temperature. And that one being stuck up, it's more likely to turn to cancer and things. So now he's past the six, seven month where it should have dropped, I'm going to take him to get it checked out and just to see what's best to do because I don't want him getting poorly. So, yes, there's my POA. Not sure what I'm going to do, whether I'm going to cut lunch or leave it, but we've got 900 <laughs> Hello Fresh meals. And, yeah, so, love the jacket. I'll try and remember to link it down below. And I am going to... I'd like some lunch, but I don't want to make two if it's gonna get like not eaten. Do you know what I mean? Anyway. Just bought them on another little walk. I love how happy they are playing with the ball. Hello, come on then. Good boys. They're so cute. We're just waiting for my nan and Abby and then we're gonna go over to my nan's sisters. But just wanted to bring them a bit early so they got another little walk. Cause I feel bad for taking Rolo to the vets. You good boys. Hello. I'm in my, I'm in my nan's car. I, uh, it is two o'clock and we're going to go and get a subway, take one to my nan's sister. I call her auntie Janet, but it's actually obviously my mum's auntie, it's my second auntie. But I don't see her very often, she's really cute, she's like 83, something like that. Um, and yes, I am so hungry, like I could literally pass out and then we've got the vets at four... And also, not that I need to disclose it, but I just want to say, because I do promote Beth, um, who does my nails and my brows and lashes, I do pay for every treatment. I know you don't, I don't have to justify myself, but I just didn't want people to think like it was gifted or she was paying. Like, if it was, I would tell you guys, but I genuinely do love her and I pay every time. I mean, I'd love her to give me free sets, um, but I just wanted to let you know and be honest. Um, that I do, like I just wanted to let you know, like I don't do it for any reason of, apart from I do think she just does a really, really good job. But my nan's just took Ebby back into the house. <coughs> Bless me! So, yeah, I'm just arranging when I'm going to meet up with Mel. It's so warm, it's 20 degrees. I'm hot in this. This is a black sheen set with black Adenola leggings and then I've just put the new denim jacket on, I just left it on. My face looks a bit patchy from, shall we say, if I disagree over the weekend. <laughs> um, my face is a bit patchy from, one, the fight talent because she's waxed it. I look a bit patchy, Moo Moo. 
yes, I will let you know what I get from Subway. I always have the same though. I have. It's so boring. Are you ready? You guys are going to be like, what the fuck? I don't even have cheese. But I've never had a hot Subway. Like, I've never tried it. I've never had cheese on my Subway. Because I feel like if I don't have it hot, what's the point? So I literally have ham, tomato, gherkin and mayo. <laughs> so boring. But mine's really low calorie because there's literally nothing in it. So that's one good thing. So I will see you in a bit. I am hungry, this will be an everlasting love for me. Oh, she's coming, I think. Come on, then. Does anyone else's nan just takes so long? Bless her, she's so funny. Hello, hello. I did like a, a before and after picture of my, she's coming, of my eyes and eyebrows and lashes, and I just can't believe the difference. There's the before. And there's the after. Like, I know you can see, but I just can't believe these are my eyelashes. Like, I'm gassed about it. Look at this cute picture of Rory and Rolo I took on the walk. Here's Ro. And then here's Rose. Look at my angels. They're so cute. We also screenshotted some flat... My nan's doorbell. We also screenshotted some flowers that we had from my um, that we get one for the garden. There's the what's name? I don't know much is in. And that's I'm good. What's the rat? Rollo and what's name of them? What treats? Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I was on my nan's. Oh, you little thing, you. Yeah. I'm a mess. No, you're not a mess. I am a mess. I'll put it here so you're not in it. It's screwing now, is it? <laughs> um. My nan's just give me some deodorant and some treats for the doggies. She always provides treats for them, don't you? Yeah. They love it. Nanny Glennis. Yeah. So we're going to go and I'll let you know what we get from Subway. Nanny has chicken and I like ham. Hello, now we're back. Dan met us there and we've come back in Dan's van. Um, so he said leave him for a little bit until Christmas and then he's going to do the op because he's still got teeth that need to come, come out. He's a light bloomer, as we know. And he said just don't um like just leave him let him grow let him he's fine with it inside him now and he's just going to remove both testicles so he'll be okay he said the operation shouldn't be too bad he's just got to go in in two places like one for the internal but luckily we can see it and then the other one for the other testicle so he's just going to get them both removed so yeah he was really good he's um, literally a kil no yeah a kilogram more than raw he, Rory's six so it's six point something kilograms and Rory's seven point three he's a big boy so yeah my little baby's okay I just thought I would update you and we're gonna go home now it's only half past four we're gonna do a bit in the garden and then have dinner so yeah Mwah. You've been such a good boy, I'm so proud of you. And we'll go home to your brother, leaving Rory. Because I texted Dan and I said, should I bring Raw as well? Or should I just bring Ro? And he said, leave Rory, like Rory will be fine. But I just felt awful leaving Rory in the house on his own. Like I felt cruel. He like, looked at me and I thought, I feel like a bad mum, you know. But Dan said, like, it's not a day trip. He's not missing out. But I just felt bad. I didn't want to think I was, like, treating Rolo better than him. So, yeah, you've been such a good boy. So proud of you. And we're gonna, we're nearly back, aren't we? And then we'll go home. So I'll speak to you in a bit. Good morning. It is just turned six o'clock, and I'm gonna get ready for the gym. I had my coffee, and I just ordered some heat patches from Amazon because I can feel my period brewing finally. So I ordered, I just thought I'd show you because. I don't, I don't know where you live, but I've only just been able to get like the, um, oh, I've got period back, shit, <laughs> they're coming today though, um, I've only just been able to get, um, what's it called, <laughs> like when you can get it today, like today by 7 o'clock, even all my hair, I need to take it out of this plait, so, 
I managed to get these Cura heat patches. And then I've also picked up these. Which Jode had ones by the brand Harmony, but these were a pack of 10 and they were cheaper than the one Jode and they were herbal pain relief, like cool, with like no side effects, like chemical patches. I'm outside in an AMG, right outside. that has been so I haven't spoke to you today purely because basically I'm um, like I said in last week's vlog my nan hasn't been very well and she uh, was just unwell this morning and had to she had to get the ambulance out and go into hospital so I've literally just got back from hospital it's five o'clock we've been there since about half nine what a long day hey what a long day, I feel disgusting. I'm still in my gym outfit from half six, six this morning. I just feel gross. So I just thought I would check in. I haven't not vlogged for you guys for any reason other than um, my nan um, being in hospital. So we've just got back and yeah, long, long day. I'm gonna sneeze, hold on. I'm so tired. I feel like brain dead because they separated us when we got out the ambulance we separated me and my nan and we I had to just wait in a &E on my own because Daz was at work I was sweating hang on so I was sat in A&E waiting for honestly um oh, I don't know. five hours it was rough. I met a really nice couple there because I was scared to get up to go for a wee or anything because one, it was busy and I was worried about losing my place, but two, I was worried because in case they called her name because I was the only one there for her and then she had nobody to like be with her. I was just really worried. So I didn't have, um, I, do, I was too scared to go and get anything to eat, like too scared to just do anything. So. I basically just waited until Dad's got here at like two and he went and said like is there any update and they were like sorry it's really tight they were like oh yeah she's in a cubicle <laughs> so we were like right so I had my nan's phone my keys her keys everything so she couldn't message me and she um and like i said to them when i went in i was like please would you let me know like they said they will let us meet let me know when she gets put in a cubicle like gets released from the um, like the ambulance bit because i could go and see her and obviously she was on her own i was worried how she was and like just nobody told us and then when daz went they were just like oh yeah she's in a cubicle i thought she was for saying you know i've just been sat here worrying 
like my nan but you know I don't know just annoying but she's okay that's the main thing and that was my day honestly I've only I've been to that hospital once when I hurt my ankle last year but that was for like well like a couple of hours so I've never seen anything like it <laughs> it was wild the scenes in A&E like I don't know how my mum worked in A&E for so long she's only recently stopped working in A&E and like and at the hospital now she works at a surgery but I just think how the fuck did you do that because some of the people some of the things you see I felt sick like like even like some of the children that came in they looked so ill like I don't I know they're trained but like, I'd be terrified like I'd be like what the hell do I do like this like there was one child and they like weren't responding to they were like basically unconscious and then there was this lady she was been she'd been there for hours and hours like me and like she looked really poorly and she was with her husband and all of a sudden she just fell unresponsive and they had to put an alarm out get all these people rushing out i was terrified so i thought this is wild i don't know what the hell that was so yeah so that's been my day um i need some fresh air i don't know how many steps i've done i, I did quite a lot before I came out, but I think I might just take the, do the dogs a little walk just for another bit of fresh air because anyone else feel like hospital air just isn't very fresh like I felt a bit like like dead in there so I'm gonna go and get some fresh air and I'll catch up with you in a bit I'm gonna fight down later we'll perk ourselves up so maybe we'll catch up then but until then I love you and I'll see you in a bit hello I'm home I'm showered I went for another dog walk and I'm glad I, I've still managed to do like 13k steps so I'm really happy considering I've sat in the hospital for hours but that Amazon parcel that I ordered this morning came so I thought we could open it together. I know it's like probably normal for some people but I just can't believe we can get things the same day. So I've got these Cura heat ones which are like um, heat they're for period pain and they're 12 hours. I haven't actually come on yet, but just I know it'll be this week. And these are free patches and it's like probably like overnight maybe, I'm not sure. And then I also bought these. Serona Feminine Pain Relief Patch provides relief from cramps during those difficult days. 12 hour relief, 100% herbal, instant relief, no side effects. And these are cooling ones. So I thought it'd just be interesting to see which ones were better. So I will keep you updated, but I just thought I'd show you that just because I feel like all girls can appreciate a period recommendation. But I'm going to fact time later, we're going to get some food and speak to you in a bit. Hello, so I have um, eaten and we've just been watching Harry Potter, we're on a Harry Potter um, vibe at the moment. So I'm just going to put my hair in a plate, it's quite greasy but... I'm just going to make it last. I've got my retainers in. So as usual, ignore the lisp that I get. My legs are absolutely killing from the gym this morning. And then I'm going to start hair oiling tomorrow, I think. I'm sad I didn't make it to Zumba today, but as long as my nan's okay. Um, I'm just going to go in with the L'Oreal Metal Detox Oil. And I'm just going to run that through. Sorry, I've got hair in my face. I'm just going to run that through my hair, my head, like the bottom of my head doesn't sort of feel greasy at all. And then I'm just going to plait it. So I've just been using, they're from, I think they're, they're either from Silk Baby or By Sean Scrunchies. Um, this, these little ones are and they hold my hair. So I feel like they will hold a lot of yours too. And it's just so much better for your hair like although they look a bit more sleek the um like the tighter hair bands these are so much better for your hair i've put a lot of oil in the last couple of days like here and it's quite greasy but i don't mind that because i'm only going to be slipped back in i really don't want to fake tan but it's got to be done so let's plait attack i'm not a good platter so don't judge Let's just make sure that's they're gonna go back okay.
I wish I could French plait. I keep saying to Joe, like, please, will you do it on my hair? But we always forget. Um, I feel confused. So pull that. I'm not very good at playing, as we know. But it's only for bed, so it doesn't really matter. But I feel like the more I practice it, obviously, the better I'll get. I don't get how people do it like straight down through, like down the mirror. Like not down the mirror, like behind, because my arm gets all tangled and I get a bit confused here. So we've messed it up, but that's okay. I've just been finding it's quite comfy to sleep in, and I just know my hair isn't luggy or anything, like it's been a lot less luggy the last few days. Like I've always heard people say, like they sleep with it in plaits and I've never really not got it but I've never really like bothered so I'm just gonna put that in there and then just push it to the back and then I'm going to put on the Garnier natural bronzer I don't know whether to try and use the new Bondi but I don't know if I'm going to get a body out of it. As always, a a bit on the neck. And then for pet for the face. My skin is a little bit rough at the minute. To be honest with you, as you can see. But oh no, I had I had my eyebrows tinted yesterday. Will they go orange? I don't know what the right, right way to do it is. Oh well, I can't do anything there, it's on. I'm just gonna put like half a pipette on more. On my ears. And then just a little wipe over my eyes. I can't believe how long my eyelashes look, I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, tanned. To make sure there's no tan in my eyelashes. I just can't believe these are my natural eyelashes. I'm so, so happy with them. That grand eyelash really must work. Okay, tan. I'm going to try, I hope I can get her body out of it now, let's do olive, olive and caramel, no olive and golden, I don't know if I'm going get, to get, get her body out of this but I'll do, I'll see how much I can get but I'm going to mix these two, but then I probably shouldn't mix should I? But I don't know if that will do one full, does it look a lot, does it to do for one full body? Has that got like a few pumps in? I feel stressed about it. Mm. Do I just try a warm golden tone or olive? I don't know which one I would want. stressed. Do I just do warm golden? I thought that would be nice, won't it? Let's see what it looks like on the mid. You guys can see. Do we put it on the neck? Does it look very warm? Mm. 
is it? I wouldn't say that's warm at all, just like classic Bondi. Mm. I don't know if to abort mission. Right, I'll let you know what happens. I have no idea what I look like, but I did the orange on top and I did the green on the bottom. You can't really see, but I'll show you in the morning. Good morning, best friends. So, I've woke up and I'm very underwhelmed with the tan. It's caused a huge, like, mark. Like, it's really clung to my neck and it's made it, like, sore here, like a horrible patch. You see, I I'm just underwhelmed, to be honest with it. It's okay. But I used the different colour on my legs. I'd say it's quite drying, like... Uh I've, and I really like Bondi, so I'm a bit annoyed. I, I feel like it was a bit shit. I can't lie. Uh, unsure, feeling underwhelmed by it all. My hair is just got wet in the shower, which is annoying. We just went for an hour walk with Joe and her mum. Went to the gym. I did chest this morning. And I'm literally just going to... I don't know, my hair is greasy AF. So I'm going to slick it back. And I believe the wavy ponytail plait it or I don't know do something with it I'm not sure what to do with it the ends feel literally gorge gorgy porge so Joe's on the way we're gonna film a get ready with me and yeah and we're gonna then go and try we're gonna do two videos Joe's gonna I don't know who's gonna have to get ready with me um and then we're gonna film like a chat in the car with and get some try the new Costa drinks so that is today's plan Dan's at home today he's doing the garden so he's outside with Lena the lawn and yeah I just I don't know I woke up and I was like Oh, like I just instantly didn't like like feel very attached to the tan. I just felt a bit like that. All you've got, you know. And like, I'm pissed off that the the dry spot is right on my neck because it looks shit. So I think I'm just gonna scrub it off, moisturise, and go over my neck again. I think. Never get, I've got two holes in one in my earrings, so oh, I'm just discovering, discovering, thinking what to do with my hair. I don't know if to leave it down and let the waves, or just lick it up. Should we get it up and out the face? I'm just gonna put my skincare on, so I've got my serum. I need to start, she said start putting some castor oil on your lashes, but I always forget I need to start doing that again. Put my plumping thing, Bondi Sands SBF. This little skin saffron. I think a mix of the period and the chemical peel have made it a little sad. But I've had quite a long like I haven't worn makeup since Friday so I think that has done my skin wonders to be honest like having just no makeup just letting it really breathe like I only put fake tan drops on it Sunday nights and then last night but that always makes my skin look worse it like really reddens it So yeah, that's that's all I have to say. I'm feeling fine. I just feel a bit, you know. I think it's my period. I just feel a bit offish. I think yesterday was obviously a bit of a stressful day, and then I've just woke up this morning. And I just feel a bit mood swingy. I'm not. I like. I feel happy, but I feel like, you know, you just feel a bit temperamental. <laughs> so I'm just gonna have a good try and have a good positive day 
sun shining, it's bright days, let's be happy. Let's be happy. Jode is thrown on a thing on her way. We've, I've been invited to a premiere next week, but I don't know whether I'm gonna go or not. It's for the new one of, I don't know if I'm allowed to say what it's for, but I don't know whether to go or not. It's just gonna be a long day. Um, but like most events that you get invited to like are all in London so I feel like you're just not doomed if you don't live near London but it's a lot harder and like because of the doggies and stuff it just makes it a little bit more difficult I'm just going to put on my Bobby Brown and Drunk Elephant I haven't opened my new ones yet they're still they're still they're like getting low but they're still here which just shows how much product you get when I bought this in February it's wild. So I used the warm golden tone on my upper body, the orange Bondi Sands, and I used the green one on my lower body. So I don't know. I don't know why I've like just woke up and been like, I think the neck's really annoyed, like not annoyed me, but like I'm just like, oh, didn't expect that from you, Bondi. So I might put a bit of concealer on it. anything about a white top it's very risky risky bisky so i'm just gonna go and blend with a brush just to make sure we don't get the top lots of renovation going on on the street at the moment so we've got down in the garden and they're like they do like a big extension two doors down from us so they are having a crazy like the work they've had done is honestly crazy them they've made the house look so different it's wild so so different it's mad what like i obviously it's mad what renovating can do but like when you like see the change like it must be crazy like building your own house because it's wild just like renovating your own house like I think that's crazy but actually like 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 building the whole foundations and like seeing it go from like a rubble must be wild like knowing you've picked every part of that must be crazy 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 I'm just trying to make a bit of space so for when Joe comes she's not know where to do her makeup I'm getting a little bit low on this one which makes me sad I feel like it definitely brightens I also haven't put mascara on my eyes since I had the LVL so I'm excited to see what it looks like but I'm going to delete some storage on my laptop on my laptop on my camera and I will be back in a bit we've just got back from B&M 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 haul oh, the best thing and the first thing we got this duvet cover pardon you £30 it's this like black and white really nice quality duvet cover so I'm gonna put that on tonight Got this, we have the French soap one at the minute, and this is the Flash Multipurpose Bicarb Sova with eucalyptus, Bicarb Sova, Sova, and um, Soda with eucalyptus. Mmm, that smells really fresh. That's really, really nice. Got these from Sainsbury's, Red Onion and Chive mm -hmm. Bagels. Home. Oh, they smell so fucking good. Milk, dog meat. For me, then we got the Flash Power Mop Absorbing Pads. We personally love these. We never really found a mop that we loved. Got some Sutton and Chris multi pack. Got some kitchen roll. What are you laughing at? Very loud. He was walking and waiting. Was it? We got some gardening tools. Dan picked up this 
throw up. Only a pound? Yeah, they were all a pound. Not bad, is it? Um, I wonder how good quality they'll be. No, I don't know. Got a trowel. A cultivator. And a garden fork. <coughs> Dad killed with a cultivator. <laughs> Um, these from Sainsbury's, these sc nuts and chocolate coated granola balls. How you meant to say it? I don't know, but it's definitely not sc. Coffee pods, these are really nice. Recommend these from Sainsbury's. They also do me like white rose. Got some pegs, which is what we went for. Say no. <laughs> Just what you pig. Got this for upstairs, gonna put it in the bedroom. I don't know what, <laughs> I don't know what it smells like. It smells like the Maldives, so I don't know how you put Maldives in a scent, but yeah, it says melon, white flowers, and warm vanilla. We've got some Marmite. That bagel, the red one you didn't try with butter and bagel. No, butter and marm. Oh, it is. We've, oh yeah, you know, you already knew this was going to be in there. I had to get a top of my fave mouthwash. I've never actually tried this, but um, this is meant to be amazing. And it's they've got to be glued. Got some cocoa butter moisturiser. Got this candle, which is called a soft sunset scented candle. Three pounds smells incredible. And then picked up. Chocolate hazelnut, like bickies for them. And then we also bought a refill of Jack cakes because we're obsessed. So that's the haul. We need to tidy up a little bit really. I'm gonna change the bed. We're gonna have dinner. Dan got very burnt in the garden today. I told him to put sun cream on, but he didn't. I think we're gonna have the aubergine curry. It's one of the- Starving. It's one of the, we're not having dinner till we've had done our jobs tomorrow. Um, we're having this. <laughs> do you want one of you, do you want to try one of the biscuits? Yeah, come on, come in to give a review. I think you've got sunstroke. Well, how have you said that? How have you worked that out? I'm just making rumours up. Yeah. For the vlog. Just because I'm a bit red. Dan's got sunstroke. You really need to be careful though, the skin is your vessel shouldn't be taking it for granted like that to protect it. This is what we're going to have for dinner. We've really been enjoying HelloFresh this week, haven't we? We're going to order it for next week too. Yeah. I'll, this is obviously isn't sponsored, but I'll put my code on screen in case any of you are, oh, are interested. Free. Come on, to give them a show. Nah, show them. Not close enough. Put it by the lens. That's it, yeah, get the angles, babe. Come on. Oh, you want one? No, come and give them a, you're not in it. Oh, the shit. Boop, dad. Oh, there. Is that Nutella? I mean, I wouldn't say it's Nutella, I'd say it's... They'll be the chalk <laughs> Yeah. You could do with the whole thing being covered in it. And then a bit dry? Bit, yeah. Oh, that's a shame. No wonder they're running off quick. £1.29. That's the review on there. <laughs> um, I'll think I'll save the calories and not try. Don't bother. So, we're going to change the bed, take the washing upstairs, put a wash on. The only perk of this weather being tonight, we've been leaving the washing on overnight and it's spectacular when you wake up, isn't it? <laughs> not sure if we should be recommending. You're not boring. I'm boring. <laughs> It's not very really kind, that is, is it? <laughs> Don't be so unkind. I'm so boring. <laughs> you feel bad? Me? Do I feel bad for calling you boring? No. You've spoken about washing being left out of a spat in your head. Um, oh. Being left out overnight. Yeah. Mm. So tired. Oh, Rory! Come and tell them, 
if you want a new home. Everyone, my name is Rory Dean and I'm just looking for someone to look after me new. Because my mum and dad are so cruel. <laughs> they don't let me have a bell vita. <laughs> Guys, look at our fat boy road. <laughs> well, the one ball of Wimblebury. <laughs> one testicle. One testicle. We saw it we saw it when he was lying down, guys, the little ball. Bless him. A shame, isn't it? Yeah. He'll always be my little baby. You'd think he had five sets of balls the way he acts. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're gonna feed our dogs because it's tea time. We're gonna get a move on. Dan was telling me actually quickly before we move on um, that he was listening to a podcast and it was about procrastinating and they, they said um, that one good way to like help stop procrastinating is like say if you just really want to scroll on TikTok for 10 minutes or like Dan wants to play a card instead of doing it now do what you're supposed to be doing and let yourself do it in 10 minutes and like give yourself the reward but like try and train your brain to wait for that reward and get what you need to do done first and then allow yourself time to have the fun. So, just in case anyone wanted that productivity tip, maybe we'll try and let you know. We've got to, we can only have dinner in 10 minutes. <laughs> got to change the bed first, for that long only 10 minutes. Whatever, I'm so boring, but... <laughs> <laughs> I believe that all of your dreams are decorations. You took my heart, all my keys, and my patience. You took my heart, I'm a sleep for decoration. You mistaken my love, I brought for you for foundation. All that I wanted from you was to give me something that I never had. Something that you never seen. Something that you never been. Mm -hmm. But I wake up and I nothing's wrong. Just get ready for work, 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 work. To me, I'll be working. You see me do me da 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 da. So me by that word 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 word. Da 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 da. When you walk out, da 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 da. Before the table turn 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 turn. Beg you something, please, baby, don't you leave. Don't leave me stuck here in the streets. Oh. If I got another chance to, I will never, no, never neglect you. I mean, who am I to hold your best against you? So I didn't really catch up with you last night because we honestly just had one of the evenings like Joe had left at like like four, half four and then we went to B&M when I obviously gave you the haul and then we looked literally because we've been doing the garden we've been tidying everything and everywhere and we just like spent all night cleaning and then like I made my hello fresh meal and that was the first hello fresh meal I just didn't enjoy because it was like it was called creamy aubergine curry and I just it was really coconutty and if you guys watch me you know I will not I do not like coconut so it's nothing against the you know it, I just didn't like that recipe so I just really didn't enjoy it so I had a crisp sandwich I literally just gave it to Dan um, and he ate what he could and then I put the rest in the bin because I just I literally hate coconut and like I've had coconut milk in a curry before this was the one that was randomly sent to me and I just absolutely hated it like I just couldn't eat it um, and I'd never had aubergine before and I wasn't a massive fan I will say that so and then I was just honestly shattered because we cleaned like it was just a bit of a you know and then this morning got up and went for a walk and now I'm gonna get ready for the day and then we're gonna go and we're gonna record the podcast and then I'm going take going a walk with my nan then we're gonna go for lunch 
and then I think we are going to what else are we gonna do I'm just gonna open my yogurt I've got the this one and I'm recording a what I'm gonna die for TikTok so one sec let me just take a little dicky of that I hope it's nice I feel like I've tried it before but I don't know if I have It's a bit like the phage ones where like you pour it in and it's got like nuts, granola and dark chocolate in which are obviously quite good for you. So yeah, so that's the plan today and then I'm going to my nan's, my other nan, Nanny Glennis, tonight for dinner. And I said to her, don't worry because you haven't been very well but she wants to so let the woman do what she wants to do. nice I'm gonna get my knee and oh, I'm gonna use the new some new products well I'm gonna use the new this I'm gonna underpaint if you've seen it on TikTok so I'm just going to use a couple of new things. I'm going to make a TikTok as well. I've got a calcium spot under my eye and it's pissing me off. That's so annoying. Let me know if you get a calcium spot. I don't really know why you get them. Or why they're called calcium spots. But yeah. This is the Primark like Max Strobe Cream dupe. Haven't used it yet, so let's try. Oh, it's definitely got a glow. That's really nice. That's added a lovely glow. Okay. Okay, Primark. Four pound fifty, that has added such a nice glow. I'm gonna go in with my drunk elephant drops. for that interlude and uh, just went to work my be beauty bill and and the period came so for real um i thought i was in pain and that is why uh what we're we doing now this is how it looks so i've literally just the dab the concealer i've not put anything else on i don't know what i'm looking for concealer on my spots right i'm just gonna spot conceal like everywhere that i don't want on show if you like literally just there and then I'm going to put the other Maybelline. Oh, my tummy hurt now. <laughs> mm, not a vibe. Right for that it's here, but 25th, let's write that down in the period diary here. Let's, last May, I came on the 20th. And the May before that, in 26th. And the May before that, the 9th. Wild. Bodies and periods are so wild. I've just downloaded Flow actually, and I've obviously got the app 28, which is more for tracking your cycle, what phase you're in. I don't really like that you have to pay. Anyway, I'm gonna blend this in.
This is the My Bomb Mitchell sponge. And I'm just dragging this under where I contoured. I don't know if I like, went over my underpainting a little bit. Let's just dab my cheeks back on. Are you meant to wash your sponges? I've only used this a couple of times. Let's put a bit of lip balm on, I think. Get rid of that. Okay, now I'm going to go around the perimeters with the glow. This is what the face is looking like really happy with it so I'm just gonna add I'm a bit scared a bit of glow like around the perimeters like I'm a bit, I don't know if I'm really doing it right I don't really feel like I need much but I'm just gonna add a little bit of glow around the edge and see what happens I'm gonna carry on and do the rest of my makeup guys and I shall be back okay I'm ready this is the skin got these boho moon earrings in they're giving like Fendi vibes just got this tracksuit on, I'm feeling a bit rough, so might have a banana, see if that helps with the period bed, plaited the hair, but yeah, it's so giving like my skin, but better. Do you look what Jade's bought us, bubble tea. <laughs> How fun. Her vlog already know about this. Yes, I said to my vlog, I'm going to surprise Mia. <coughs> We're going to have a look, there's... So what you get in it is, it's on TikTok and there's already like pre-made like set so you have to obviously like pick right. a set that suits you i don't know if you could customize i just picked one that same like it would please us both so we've got lychee bubble syrup passion fruit like um passion fruit bubble tea syrup and then we've got strawberry bubbles and lychee bubbles and you add 40 ml of this to a cup add 200 ml of water two handfuls of ice so, shaker does it say? Yeah, but we could just. Shall I put it in the face? Yeah. Let me see if we've got a lid. Do you want to to balance your vlog? Oh, the thing usually works, the air fresh if you turn it the other way, like vertical. Bubble tea is about to happen, guys. So the longer way to bubble tea. I'm very excited. Yeah. So, I'm going to have. I think I'm going to have lychee bubbles in passion fruit syrup. Yeah, I'll have passion fruit syrup, strawberry bubbles. Yeah. How exciting. I'm absolutely cool. buzzing. I'm really excited. Bubble tea! I'm just trying to find mm. all the protein shake in it. The bubbles are good. Are they? Yeah, just try them on. <laughs> okay, so. We're adding four, so we add a third of this to 200 mils of water, some ice, shake it, and then add the boba bubbles. We might just have to... Um, How fun. Give it a little... Bit. Yeah. Okay. okay, right. So, how many much water? 200 mil. I've got a mushroom here. So, should we put 400? Um, um, yeah. Or, yeah. yeah. And ratty protein shake, don't judge. And then it's going to be two thirds of this. Can you do that? Move the oh, oh, stuff out your mouth. Do you not smell good? Like, no, it's just strong, you know. Come strong on. syrup. Ooh! Gasp! Mm -hmm. it. Ooh, she's thick. So we're doing two thirds? Yeah. Maybe a bit. A bit too much. A bit of ice now, yeah? Yeah, a bit of ice. And then. Bubbles, shake, 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 shake it, shake, shake. I think even just a, a spoon. A, yeah, just a mix. We'll probably do it, won't it? I'm so excited, Jen. I can't believe we get the straws. Oh no! When did you get it? Um, on the weekend, and it came. How long did it take to come? Two days. days. Not long. Like it come, and I was like, gosh, it's here already. Like the fuck? I think it came on Tuesday. 
I don't know how much. We don't want to be warm, do we? Came on Tuesday. I'm sure I only ordered it maybe on Friday, Saturday. Oh, like, what a surprise. I'm oh, so man. excited. But we always say, like, oh, I wish we could have more bubble Not a lot. No. I'll find it on Sunday. <laughs> Look at the bubbles. It was £25. I mean, but maybe that's a bit. For two drinks. Well, it, no, no, it, yeah, it makes. Oh my god! Wow! Yeah, it was twenty five pound. I mean, for a fun activity though. How nice! And do I show everyone? Yeah. Oh, hang on. <laughs> See ya. Mm. It's the pot. It's the pot. I could just drink that juice off the back. Oh no. So how many bubbles? It want? just says add bubbles, so as many as we want, I imagine. This is so exciting. Right. I feel like she's mixed. You want lychee bubbles? Uh, or yeah. sure. No, lychee. lychee, please. Lychee for me. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Couple more? I don't know how many we'd normally have. A bit more. Yeah, a bit it's like, more. Not, it like swims the bottom, doesn't it, yeah. usually? You boys, you don't understand how exciting this, this is. This is fucking exciting. This is like our version of dog poo. <laughs> Horse poo. Yeah, rolling in it. Yeah. I hope. Wonder what it would taste like. Yeah. Oh, the bubbles. We should have done a TikTok really, shouldn't we? I know. Well, I might make one later. Yeah, doing a bubble tea it's at bit, home. It's a bit much, isn't it? Right now, with all the yeah, all the devices. Looking like that, I think. Yeah. And then should we tip them? I'm nervous. Tip them harder. <laughs> oh, yours is like changing colour. That looks like Yay. sunset. Yours looks pretty. It's like a cocktail. Done it. It's all inclusive cocktail. Wow! Thank you. Right, let's get our shots. Yeah, go on. Yeah. It does come with little proper cups too. Bubble tea, bubble tea, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they look so they cute. They look fucking sick. This is your sign to make them. I love it, I'm so excited. This would be cute, you know, if she's having like a little sleepover. <gasps> oh, look. They look they so, look so cute. cute. Are you getting confused with our phones? Oh, no. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with them. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're okay there. Your, your new phone just won't save. Like when you text me this morning, it still come up like the number. Do you need to delete the old I have. Oh. I don't know what's going on. So I added it and just deleted it. What the hell? Let's see it goes. We, oh yeah, sorry. Woo! Yeah, let's try. Should we do a taste test? Yes. Yeah. I'm nervous. Me too. <laughs> you ready? Yes. Mm. The bubbles. Oh my god, that's good. That's really nice. Oh, I can really taste the light in the bubbles. You want to try that? Mmm. Those are really good too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, they're both really good. This has like a cocktail. It does. Like a holiday yeah, drink. Yeah, it's just a strawberry like syrup. It, it's like made it up yeah. like a grenadine, yeah. hasn't it? Oh my god, how fun. This was such a good idea, Jode. What can I say? Mmm. Really good. I'm obsessed. I'm that is such a fun gift. Obsessed. Isn't it? Yeah. Nice little thing like, you know, you want to get someone something fun. Oh my god, wow. I could just drink it all right this second. Me too. I'm gonna really try and be We need to there. try and um, save you. I just want all the bubbles. I oh know, that's the thing. Mmm. Right, we're gonna record the podcast today. Yeah, go to make a TikTok and like link it for you guys. Because. Yeah, I might make one later after my dinner. Oh, oh my god, yeah, little treat. Mm. Will Ollie like it? I'd say so. He does like a bubble tea. Does he? Yeah. Because we love a bubble tea, don't we? We love a bubble tea. Oh, so you did, we haven't had, so you've got a bit of the passion fruit and then lychee left. And then I'd say, what, how many more would you, oh, we should have put them in the cups, I don't think. Yeah. 
Um, um, we maybe you've got like you can make maybe six. Yeah, I was gonna say you got about four more. Yeah. Would you yeah. say? So, I mean, six bubble teas would cost you eight six, for. It's probably about the sixteen. About the same, yeah, amount, isn't it's it? Probably because two to costs about eight fifty. Well, yeah. Right. Yeah, they're about four pound each. But yeah, so you're probably 60. talking the, the same amount. But we, we don't have bubble teas near us other than the Costa. But that's nicer than the Costa. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. For sure. Just careful with these. They're not very on. Yeah. Okay. Don't want them spilling. Yeah. Car. Okay. Okay. Fuck the sisters and so squash. I oh, know. Bubble tea only here over here. Do you, right, we'll catch you after. We've okay. Prepared. So we're just sorting our notes out this week's ep is on how we're glowing up for summer so yes we've got a lot of ways internal external spiritually physically mentally and just like really stickly to obviously like no one's expecting a full transformation just little things that we can all do to like feel just our daily best. habits yeah. and like things like oh, that, that camera in here just to, like feel did our best it, you know? it, darling or did you bring it in that's mine isn't it, it you sure yeah, I thought so. You haven't put it on the unit, have you? So, yeah, so... Yeah, just little things that we can all do, like a little reminder, I think, of like, oh, I could totally do that and feel better. Yeah. Just little little self-help habits. Yeah. One second, guys. Also, if you haven't already, I forgot to say, because we did it in the other video yesterday, we had the iced Costa oh, whiplash, as I completely forgot so to say. Good. They were incredible. Go and watch the TikTok if you haven't, but like... The uh, we think the caramel was better, but we found out the vanilla has white chocolate syrup in, hence why it tasted like vanilla. Yeah, because it tasted really creamy, but like the, Milky Bar almost. Yeah, it did. The caramel was just something else. Like it was more like of a <gasps> like the vanilla was nice, but the caramel shocked me. I was like, oh god, I could really. That was more this. dirty. Yeah, I could it really felt more this. naughty. Definitely. So we really recommend oh. trying it. But the dogs are sleeping, nice which is good. Drink. We've got quiet dog. The spider piggy. Do you think the camera looks a bit weird? Do you think we look a bit distorted up there? Yeah, I don't know if it's because it's tilted. Do you know? Hello guys, I'm really struggling. My favourite pain's really bad. I've just took some paracetamol. Um, but I just feel really... It's, I don't remember it being this bad this last month. I feel rough. Um, so I am just on the way to walk, as I said, I don't with my nan. We're just going on another walk, but not good. Feeling, feeling good, like I should. So yeah, that's the vibes. I'm gonna walk and then we're gonna get some lunch. I don't feel very hungry, I just feel meh. I don't know if that patch is helping to be honest. That's the vibes. I'm five minutes away anyway, so I just wanted to check in. I don't even know why because this isn't an entertaining clip at all. I'm not even listening to any music, I'm just sat in silence. <laughs> 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 I'm just on the way to my nan's. I'm, my nan went home after lunch, and honestly, I just did edit, finished editing my video, and went to literally just chilled. I my period pain feels better now, so it's quarter to six. Just on the way to my nan, she's cooking us dinner. Bless her. I'm starving. I'm really, really hungry. I didn't eat all my slim chickens. I feel like I like the idea of slim chickens more than I like the actual like thing. I don't know why. Um, but I thought we could just listen to some songs and just go. I've got the boys in the back because I like to take them with me so they can play with. Well, I say play with Evie. She doesn't. She's a bit old for playing, but I just like to take them everywhere I go. As you know, ah, can't go. This roundabout is vile. Shorty coming over, shorty can fend the up, but she like fresh and over everything. I got what you need, you get what you please. We about to get it up. Cody, turn me up. Cody, play your song and tell me where you've been.
next time I weekly vlog, like, she's so like it's TikTok. I'm so like energetic. I, I think I'm gonna bite the bullet and do it. Uh, wait, what's it called? In a mince to Kimber um, and top. Happy Friday, we're going to get a coffee from Mackey's and then we're going to go and get on the train to go to Birmingham. I've got to do some filming in Birmingham for Superdrug and Tweezerman. So I'm off there this morning. I'm all ready for the day. I'm just going to get a iced latte. I can buy myself a I've got my card holder, I've got my lips combination, I've got my keys. Oh, I've got Dan's AirPods, I might take them with me. I think I've got everything I need. I don't need a lot, do I? Have I got any change for the car park? Yeah, I've got two pound. Okay, feel good. Be lit. I'm gonna get a boost for breakfast, I'm starving. It's 10 past eight. Come on. Uh, no, thank you. It's okay, we like all of that. Can I just get a nice latte, please? Medium or large? Uh, large, please. Yeah, anything else? Uh, no, thank you. The iced coffee from Mackey's is so low calorie, guys. It's like the regular is 100, and I think the large is like 120. Like, it is not bad. I've got on this grey, the I don't know top, I don't know leggings, New Balance socks, and then I've got this PRT blazer, and I've got my favourite little bag, and I've took, took the shoulder, shoulder strapping in case I need it. I'm not planning on doing any shopping, but I would like a Primark haul, so I'm going to go to Primark. Um, it doesn't open till 10, so by the time I've had a boost, gone to Primark, I'm then going to go to... I'm just going to have a nice leisurely walk around for and I'm so excited. So if I see anything nice in the shops, I will show you, I promise, because I'm not filming any other video apart from the TikTok for Tweezerman, so I'm all yours. I'm all yours, besties. I will show you any nice bits I see, and yeah, I'm excited. I feel nervous. I always get nervous to go on my own, little solo shopping trip, but it's so nice when you do go. Like, I love going with Joe, but it is nice to go by yourself as well, you know, you're not in a rush. Um, and it's nice to not be going to film any specific video so I can literally just have a moot shopping. So I never go and just shop, I go like to do a come shop with me, you know. So I feel like I'm really excited, there's a few little bits I want from Primark and I'm just excited that I'm going to come back, see my nanny and then I'm going to walk the dogs and then I'm going to go look after Bella this afternoon. My nan's going out for the night so I'm taking her to, I'm dropping her off at Miller and Carter and then we've got bells for the night. So that's my plans this evening. Hello. Hi. Yeah. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye. I'm hope Maya's coffee's nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank, Thank you so you much. Enjoy. Have a good day. Bye. I bought a new muff on the camera guys as well, so I should be able to vlog outside and it not bother you. Whoa, I could do with just slitting this open. There's a car behind me. That made me coffee this morning and it was absolutely awful, bless him. I don't know what he put in, it tasted like friggin. It just was like water, wasn't cute. So I thought, mm -hmm, that's okay. I will make myself a, I will treat myself to a nice coffee on the way, darling. So this is my first coffee in the morning. I feel like the first coffee just hit. Ready? Mm. When you go to McDonald's and get a nice coffee, don't get anything in it. Come on. I'm just, it's interesting taste. It's like I don't know what the taste is. But there's a syrup in there already. I feel like 
haven't been very chatty the last couple of days, so I am sorry. I haven't just felt like rambling, I've just felt a bit it's the period, you know. If you know, you know. It's one of them. I don't know, I forgot to put my cool patch on. And I forgot to bring a spare pad. Shit. I should be okay. It's okay. We'll be fine. We're in a we're in a shopping centre, we'll be fine. What can go wrong, okay? And I just put specifically put on a blazer that covered am I going the wrong way? Yeah. My bum. Just you know, just in case. My train's in 20 minutes. So I'm a bit early, but I do have anxiety of missing the train. And these tech trains have a tend to come on like a couple minutes before the time. Like they come like early and they fucking leave. Like you've got no minute to spare. I left my hair like in a in a pony because I plaited it last night. But I'm not sure. It's like wavy now. But whether it stays wavy is another question. Jade's going on a spa day today, so I hope she has a lovely day. I'm excited to watch the vlog if she gets any clips. I don't know whether she'll be able to. But I'm excited for her to come back and then give me her review. I won't see her now, so I saw her yesterday, so we won't see each other until Tuesday, so that's long for us. Um, it's beautiful blue skies down. I'm worried I'm going to be sweating. Oh, she's got a coffee too. I don't know what it is about a morning coffee, but it just makes me really happy. Should we say what we're grateful for today? So, I'm grateful for... Oh, I always say three things. I always say more than three. I'm grateful for waking up today. I'm grateful for being able to go shopping, having the chance to go shopping on my own. I'm grateful for my family. I'm grateful for my best friend. I'm grateful for my boyfriend. I'm grateful that me and my family are healthy and happy. I'm grateful for all the opportunities I receive and I'm just grateful for my job and I'm grateful for life honestly I'm grateful for food, being able to afford food and things like that little side note I ordered some new clothes on not clothes I ordered some new trousers on because I really like Joe's H&M trousers however um what's her name she's an influencer and it, this influence right that name will come to me she had some like baggy pinstripe ones kind of like the h&m but from pot and like they were only literally in size on in stock on my size so i was like i'll take you so i bought them and yeah so they're coming today so i'll show you and we could try them on together i just want to get i need some more like basic tops i think so i might have a look excuse me i'm sorry um i don't know if i have a look maybe primark or Zara, I could do with a few bags. I can't put this down. Oh, I'm glad I found it early. I was really panicked. I hope I did Canic to Birmingham right and not Birmingham to Canic again. Because that's a toxic trait of me, is. Oh, the car park is dead. Right. Let's just go and get an all day ticket. Will my coffee be okay there? Two pound coin. Right, I'll be two seconds. I'm a bit worried about my coffee. I think it'll be safer there. Train ticket secured. All day ticket. Right, let's just check the train time and put our lip combination on. Okay, let's put our lip combo on. I just grabbed anything off the side at this point. Um, we've got NYX Free Spirit. Is this one? Oh no, it's okay. NYX Free Spirit. Oh, my makeup's a bit patchy, I can't lie. I literally had such a, not like a slow morning. Well, it was, like I literally got up at half five and just watched youtube for an hour and a half which was so nice lips on got everything i need got my phone right let's start the tiktok for tweezer mum
made it. So I'm just gonna go over the bridge to Bullring and then I'm going to get a boost. I'm gonna get a peanut chocolate and then we'll go to Primark. Hiya. Oh, yeah. yeah, can I get a regular peanut chocolate and a bottle of water please? Try double fruit and a peanut chocolate. No thank you. Okay, thank you, no problem. Thank you. No Have a good day. Bye. Mm. So good, I'm going to go and film in Super Drug, get that done, and then we're going to go to Primark. Okay, work is done. I've done the bits in, twe um, in Tweezum and in Super Drug. I've secured some bits because I really wanted a scalp brush, and there's just other little bits that I saw that I thought, oh, I'll pick up. So, I don't know where to go next. I feel like I just want to go and reach about Primark. So, I'm going to go to Primark, Zara, H&M, maybe H&M home, and then that's it. But I'm out of breath walking up the hill. So, I'm going to go into there and I'll show you what I see. And let's hope we can even get a haul for you guys. This is really cute. In Primark, got some cute bits in the basket. But I thought this was cute, but I just think it's not going to fit nice. Look how cool these are guys. I've been way too happy spending, it's it's a problem. Just in the train, just in the changing rooms. And I thought these little cute shorts were nice for holiday. I've got loads of stuff. But I thought these were really cute. This is so nice with trousers or just as like a little shirt dress. Love it. How nice is this guys in H&M? Hello, we've secured quite a few bags. My arm's so tired. I just picked up a bagel from the bagel factory. I've never tried them before. Look at the sweat on my head. I'm so freaking hot. And then I'm sat down waiting for the train. And then we can try the bagels together. I hope you can hear me. Primark was very successful. Got a couple of bits from Superdrug, two tops from H&M. Sorry I haven't called you because I was holding my bags myself. I, because um, I was holding my bags myself, I just did, couldn't have the camera. Um, See, so I wasn't forgetting about you. Um, I got the deli bag from the bag factory. I've never actually tried it before, so I'm really excited. And I am so excited to film this Primark haul. Primark was so good. I got like really just nice spring summer bits and I tried everything on to make sure I wasn't wasting any money. And yes, yeah, so there's been quite a bit, but new clothes hey um at least we've got a video for you guys so i refilled my water in birmingham i've never didn't know you could do that um in primark by the greggs if you're local you can fit refill your water and i thought because i was going to buy another water bottle um so i don't know if to wait the train's not coming till for another 20 minutes so i might start eating my bag now so let's try and get it out and try it how incredible does this look oh, it's just insane to the old lady that I sat next to and she was really really nice. She was going to Liverpool. It's so cool that everyone has such different lives isn't it? Oh, I just loved her. She was really sweet. Okay so we've just come on a walk. I'm meeting my nan and dad. I've just changed into this little green set and it feels so good. Rolo! Rory, ready? The grass is everywhere. <laughs> Have fun, Ro. Have fun, Ro. Who's that, Ro? Who's that, Ro? Nanny. <laughs> Rory just knows. You want the ball? He just knows it's <laughs> Nanny Glennis and, and Ebbs. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Baby 
Incredible, I found one of these in Birmingham today, and I, of course, got it. You would, I, I sorry, I was like, I'll have to. <laughs> Took them to the till. So, gosh, today has gone so quickly. I've got a few little blemishes, so please ignore my hair. Is like wet, but like, oh, I can't even talk about it. Really recommend this. Really, really, really recommend this. It's so good, but don't use it if your hair's not greasy because it like makes it like crunchy, but incredible. It's held my hair amazing. Like when I had flyaways, I brushed them back down. Like I tried on 30 things in Primark today. Pretty much perfect all day. Really recommend. But I, I'm gonna do a Primark haul, which will be Tuesday's video, but I thought I'd show you what else I bought. So I bought these plain tops from H&M. They were really cute. The tag, I think the tag's come off this one, but I got them both in a small, 9 99 this one was, it feels really nice. And then I got this like gray, oh here you are, here's the code for it. And then I got this gray one, this is in a small too, but this was 5 99 and they just felt really, nice for a colour difference this is like a whitey grey marl this is white it's like an it's a really really nice colour i then bought a few things out of super drug i bought a scalp brush no scalp scrub a pre-shampoo scrub to remove build up from the scalp and hairline <coughs> sorry helps to reduce dandruff stimulates hair follicles and helps improve scalp and there's this brand in there called the hair boss has this got a so with a lid on it, no. Oh, it smells like tea tree. Didn't expect that. And the, the aesthetic was everything. I loved it. And it had all different stuff to do. Oh, okay. It's the perfect pre-wash exfoliator that helps remove dirt and oil from the hair follicle, leaving the scalp free from the build-up of dry shampoo, styling products designed to be used weekly. The scrub boasts tea tree oil and rose bay extract that helps you reduce dandruff and encourage the scalp's natural ecosystem. It's also great for removing makeup from the hairline and body. So you have da damp hair. So thought I'd give this a try. I then bought a restock of my favorite face wash, the Simple Water Burst Micellar. I then bought this, um, I, was, I don't know what people like to call it, down below wash for your vagina. Um, Woo Woo Cranberry Cleanse, gentle intimate wash with cranberry extract, aloe vera, pH balance, intimate use, vegan. And it meant to have really good properties for healing and just preventing UTIs. It's got as aloe vera to cleanse the delicate part of the skin and maintain the pH balance. I oh, it smells really good. This is it. Got it in super drug and I've never seen it before. I've only ever usually seen the Femme Fresh and then they're like own brands. So got that. And then it was two for nine pounds. So I picked up the glued for brows and edges. And then I also bought this because I can use this multitasks. So this is meant to be amazing for your brow for your what? For your brows. But it's also meant to be amazing for your edges. So I thought I could use it for both. So yes, that's my little haul, got so much from Primark. Spent about £140, I think. Just shaved my legs, shaved my armpits, and I'm feeling good. I've moisturised with coconut oil in the shower. I need to moisturise my body, I need to upload a TikTok. But today was really good. I got back from Brum and then saw my nan and dad just putting one of these period patches on. I don't necessarily, I'm not in too much pain, but I could just do with a little... A little friend you know <laughs> it's like a plaster and then i just get my tum tum out i'll put it like on the lower tummy but obviously before my like i 
I'll put it on like the lower line, like my bikini line pretty much. I would say, and it has like a tingling sensation. And you can remove it as you go along with a stick. So I just brush it along the bottom and it stays stuck. And I've got my, I can't, I've got my, I can't, I've got my favourite pants on. So I'm all set for bed. But I had such a nice day. I uh, went for a coffee with my nan and dad, went for a dog walk. And then me and Dan went for a dog walk this evening and took bells because we were looking after her and then we got a gyros where well, we got a gyros bowl for tea sat and had that in my nan's garden uh we obviously dropped her off at miller and carter and then i've just had a nice shower gonna sit start editing this video and just a chill day so i hope i could show you i showed you as much as i could today and tomorrow we're going to do the garden so more of the garden transformation because i haven't actually shown you the update from this week so we've got a little fencing gate and then we're going to do the patio so I'm really excited. It's looking more like a home now. So I'm going to go edit. And if I have anything to say tonight, I will. But if not, I'll see you in the morning. Just a man. Take that pussy, drop it in. Die. 